Welcome back. I'm Ainsley Brent, and today is a very special Wednesday because it's the first time we've named two people the co WXXV Student Athletes of the Week. Twins Kylan and Jalen Howes are seniors on the Gulfport Boys basketball team. I went to their practice to see what all the hype, I mean hype, was all about when it came to this dynamic duo. News 25 Student Athlete of the Week. Brought to you by Keesler Federal Credit Union. It is my little brother. Technically, he's telling the truth, but failed to include that he's only older by 20 minutes. Identical twins Kylan and Jylan Howes are members of the Gulfport High School boys basketball team. Kylan being center and Jylan playing power forward and small forward. But there's nothing small about this pair. The Howes twins have been playing basketball since a young age, but they had to catch up with their six foot nine and six foot eight bodies first. Since elementary, but I went, we weren't that good in yeah. elementary. We weren't that, my body wasn't that coordinated yet. So by ninth grade is when I got, my right. body caught up with my height. Gulfport boys head basketball coach Owen Miller said he's gotten to witness their growth both mentally and physically firsthand, starting with their ninth grade season. When they got here, they were tall and skinny and, and uh, it was hard for them. They were still growing into their bodies and to see them develop uh, as basketball players and, and most importantly as young men uh, has been fun to be a part of. And the fun doesn't stop on the court because many fans think they're seeing double or their own classmates mistake one for the other. Colin explained that people can tell them apart by looking at their facial features or the placement of their tattoos. But if you see them on the court, you can decipher the two by their three-point celebration. All of this. All of this. I, I do head taps. <laughs> their opponents aren't at a complete disadvantage just because they were roommates. The twins explained that twin telepathy wasn't a real thing. <laughs> We can't. We do say the same thing sometimes. Yeah. Uh, I can't lie, but I don't know. About I don't know what's going on. Here, so. But one thing is for certain, and it is that they have both put in the work to get to where they are now. Just a lot of hard work out of out of practice. You gotta. You can't be good if you just come to practice every day. You gotta do it outside of school. And just work on your game and get better. With this being their senior seasons, they have individual goals that they believe will help Gulfport reach the top. Just being a better person, like on and off the court, just working hard, having a good work ethic. And basically just having, well for us as a team, our team chemistry is what brought us to be 8-2 right now. Because we got the player, but you got to have team chemistry first. And they plan on growing that chemistry throughout the rest of the year. But the Howes brothers don't want this to be the end of their basketball careers. They both currently have offers to play at the junior college level. Although they haven't committed anywhere yet, the Howes twins wish to go to the same school and then both pursue a career in physical therapy. Coach Miller said that he knows for a fact that their future will be bright. And they're funny kids, you know, they're, they're funny, they're fun to be around, uh, always have a smile on their face. They're, they're involved with campus life and uh, so yeah, they, they, and they've got a bright future. The Gulfport Admirals will face the Diaboville Warriors on Saturday at the Renee Ladner Shootout. 